Alright, what's up guys? This is TTGR bringing you another tutorial on how to be <laughs> how to beat um the 14th Spec House mission called SmackDown. Um this is kinda like the last one where you start in a vehicle and it's really, really annoying. So just take your time and um I suggest you use once again spread your fire so one person and um I suggest there's a trick you can do. What you do is while you're aiming, repeatedly tap L1 and it will lock on your next target. So that's why it kind of seems like I'm like aimbotting from time to time. It's a little going too fast, can't really notice it, but my thing's all jumpy because I'm just pressing L1 over and over. I suggest you spread your fire so that when you're reloading your Frank is there shooting. And just wait for this guy because he will shoot you and it's annoying. So shoot him before he, he pops out if you can. And same with that guy. You're going to pop out on this roof. One's going to pop out over on that side and then another over there. Don't be afraid to hold down the trigger. And they're gonna pop out on the far side again. And these guys are really hard to hit for some reason. So just keep pressing the L1 and holding the R1. And just keep your trigger down. <laughs> and if you want, you can switch to your next gun. And just start new tubing away, like I did here. And um, this is also quicker to reload. So. Jump down. I suggest you switch one of your guns. And I suggest you also spread out, but not too far away from each other. See right there is kind of like locking onto my targets. That's uh, just the L1. It, it acts like single player, so you can snap to other your the other enemies, I guess, opposition. And it just it, it's nice. I got RPG. That was not cool. It's kind of an annoying mission. I hated this one. Just like the last one, we, me and my friend really, really hated it. And um, single player, basically the same thing. I, I got, I played this one single player by myself. The helicopter's not so bad when you're doing it by yourself. Yeah, I was gonna say, um, if you're playing two, I suggest one of your friends pick up the sniper rifle. Um, whoever's better at sniping, and then have your other friend kind of walk up, and he'll draw the spawns, and this will give you time to um, snipe. Um, I don't suggest moving over here. I thought uh, I would give him better cover from over here, but um, I can't actually give him better cover. So right here is the most open spot. You can see basically everything. And um, then he went down. So once you clear that first spawn, you can move up. That's what I suggest, cause, and then move up together. Then try not to get grenaded or rocketed or RPG'd, rocketed, that's not even a word. <laughs> See, there's multiple entrances, just be careful. Watch your corners, I, like, I flashed right here, and that guy was totally ineffective by my flash. That was really confusing. There's a guy behind you also. And, um, just have a guinea pig, basically. Have someone like me that just runs through and kills everyone. And then that takes all the fire, I guess. Yeah, sorry, I just had a brain lapse there, I guess. Lapse of thought. Have someone that runs in, draws all the fire, and just have your friend kind of hold back a bit. And then, say, you, if you go down, you, your friend can pick you up. My friend's like, get out of here, it's gonna blow. And I was like, I already blew it. <laughs> See, just be careful. You're gonna have a lot of jelly on your screen. Don't be afraid to use your explosive grenades or grenade launchers, nub tubs, <laughs> noob tube. Um, I come in here, come up the stairs. There's gonna be three guys pop out on you. You come up here. There's gonna be people on this on the side. Just move up, there's gonna be no one in this building usually. If there is, I'm sorry, I must have killed them already. And then there's gonna be people opposite side of this. Um, I suggest a sniper take them out. Plant your thing, head to the next rooftop, or just underneath like I did. Uh, move up. Uh, you don't have to use a sniper for this part, I just never changed my weapon. And uh, once you're here, once your helicopter gets there, I suggest you take out as many people as possible because I believe you can take them all out. But um, 
the idea would be just to get there as fast as possible and as safe as possible. So just take your time like I am right here. And watch your map. Once you're clear like we are right now, I ran around on the side just to make sure. And then I hit the pad and I told my partner to make it. We did, and that's it. So I hope that helped a little bit if you're having some troubles. Uh, the helicopter part, I can't really help you other than just take turns and use the L1 trick where you repeatedly tap it and you can lock on your turns. Bye.